Queen Marguerite II of Denmark has issued a formal response to the outrage after she stripped four of her grandchildren of their royal titles. The monarch's own son, Prince Joachim, and his wife Princess Marie were among the critics who claimed the move was unfair on their children. Athena is bullied at school. They come and say, is it you who is no longer a princess? Marie told Danish news outlet BT. I think I have to defend our children now. She claimed the Queen's decision blindsided her, Joachim and their children, while the prince said they family were very sad about the change. Now Marguerite has responded to the backlash from her own family in a lengthy statement, where she defended her decision to revoke Prince Nikolai, 23, Prince Felix, 20, Prince Henrik, 13, and 10-year-old Princess Athena's HRH titles. There have been strong reactions in recent days to my decision to the future use of titles for Prince Joachim's four children. Of course, it affects me, the statement began. My decision has been long made. With my 50 years on the throne, it's only natural to look back and to look forward. Watch, Queen Marguerite welcomes Prince Harry to Denmark. The long serving monarch noted that it's her duty to ensure that the monarchy remains strong throughout her reign and beyond, a duty which sometimes requires making difficult decisions. Finding the right time will always be difficult, she continued, adding that the royal title she revoked would have restrained her grandchildren in the future. Prince Joachim's children are no longer called princess and princesses, nor will they continue to have the status of his slash her royal highness. This means I will be able to pursue lives and careers outside the monarchy as non-working royals, a decision the Queen sees as necessary. Crown Princess Mary and Crown Prince Frederick's children were not affected by the change. I have made my decision as a queen, mother and grandmother, but as a mother and grandmother I have underestimated how much my youngest son and his family feel, the monarch admitted in her statement. This makes a big impression, and I'm sorry for that. No one should doubt that my children, in-laws and grandchildren are my great joy and pride. I hope now we as a family can find peace to get through this situation ourselves. Watch, Mary and Frederick's children in Switzerland Though the Queen seemed disheartened by her son and daughter-in-law's reactions to the change, her statement made it clear that she has no intention to reverse the changes. It's a move that may cause further tension among the Danish royals and has sparked speculation that the UK's monarchy may soon be facing a similar situation. This is due to rumors that King Charles III will not grant Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's children, Archie and Lilibet, the titles of Prince and Princess.